This short video has been produced to help answer some of the questions you may have about what to expect during your examinations. At the entrance to the exam venue, you will find notice boards detailing the seating lists and venue layout. Find your name and seat number on the seating list and use the venue layout to find your desk inside the exam venue. Place your belongings in the room or space provided. Mobile phones and smartwatches must be switched off and placed in your bag or handed to an invigilator who will put your belongings in a property box for safekeeping. You will be given a numbered ticket as a receipt. You will need this receipt to retrieve your belongings at the end of the exam. Once at your desk, you will find an exam question paper and an exam answer booklet face down. Leave these as they are. The invigilator will let you know when you can turn these over. Place your ID on the top right hand corner of your desk. If you do not have a keel card, then please use another form of photographic ID. If you do not have any form of photographic ID, then you will need to raise your hand. Check that you have the correct exam paper. Do not open or turn over the paper until instructed to do so. If you think that you do not have the correct exam paper, please raise your hand. Before the exam begins, the invigilator will make an announcement. You will be instructed to make sure you have no unauthorised material, either on your person or on or around your desk. If you do find unauthorised material, or any other item you shouldn't have with you, put them with the rest of your belongings or hand them to an invigilator. Students are not permitted to wear a watch during exams. Therefore, all other watches should be placed in a clear plastic bag. One will be provided by an invigilator. Then place it in the top right-hand corner of your desk. The invigilator will instruct you to turn over the exam answer booklet. Write the first eight digits of your student number in the space provided on the answer book, answer sheet or exam paper. This is the first eight digits on the front of your keel card. If you are using an answer booklet, you should also write your details in the top right hand corner, then fold and seal to cover your name. There is an attendance slip in the bottom right hand corner of your book. You will need to complete this, tear it off and place it on the corner of your desk. If you are answering on the exam paper or an answer sheet, there should be a separate attendance slip provided. If you are using an answer sheet, you will also need to write the date, module code and module name on the front of the answer sheet. This information can be found on the front of the question paper. The invigilator will now announce the time and ask you to commence your examination and start writing. Begin each answer on a new page in the answer booklet. All rough work must be completed in the answer book and pages must not be torn out. You may not leave the exam venue during the first 30 minutes or the last 15 minutes of any exam. English language dictionaries are available. If you wish to borrow a dictionary at any time during your exam, just raise your hand and an invigilator will provide you with one. Please note you are not permitted to use your own dictionary and they are not allowed in any language exams. Unless the front of your exam paper states otherwise, the use of an approved calculator is permitted. They will not be available to borrow during examinations, so please make sure to bring your own authorised calculator with you. Check your calculator is listed here. The invigilator will announce when there are only 15 minutes left of the exam. At this point, no student is allowed to leave until the exam time has finished. When the examination has finished, the invigilator will tell you to stop writing. Make sure the numbers of the questions you answer are written in the relevant section on the front of the answer booklet. You must remain seated and silent until all answer books have been collected. You must not remove any answer books or question papers from the exam venue. Once the exam booklets have all been collected, the invigilator will announce that you are allowed to leave the exam.